you know, I assembled it into my modified Star Tracker, and it worked pretty well, but I had some, like, deck guiding issues, and the people on the PhD2, like, help group said that it was some stiction going on, and maybe not perfect polar alignment, uh, so I went ahead and made some changes. Uh, this used to just be an aluminum plate, which the, um, the eye polar would just be attached to, and it sat there with the, it had like a plastic piece that just separated the two, so that was in there like that, and then that sat on top of it. Well, I decided that, you know, that probably wasn't the best idea. Uh, I just didn't feel like drilling my mount at the time. So I just made this plastic bearing, I mean, plastic uh, spacer, which, um, it's, it's a little chewed up now because I, I, I had to break it out of the wires and mo tried to modify it for, like, a rough go before I, I print the new one, which is happening now. Um, oh, there's a washer in there, I can't throw it away yet. Um, yeah, what was I saying? So, I went ahead and ended up drilling these two holes. These were already here, but they... They're pretty low profile, and they're not symmetrical, which is kind of annoying, but what are you going to do? There was no room. Um, so I went ahead and put these through, and now I have these aluminum spacers, which I guess are for drones. Uh, they're pretty cheap. They're like 8 bucks for 10 or something like that. But I, I, they're actually an 8. I needed 27.99 or something millimeters to this plate. These are 8 and then 20. They didn't make 28s, like, natively, so I just took two different ones and paired them up so they're all the same height. Because uh, they're off by, like, 0 0.01 millimeters or something like that. So I paired them up so they're all 27.95 millimeters within... I think there's one that's, like, 27.94, but, yeah, no, not a big deal. Ten times more accurate than the plastic thing. Or, or maybe 30 times, because I think it was 0.3 of a millimeter, uh... Yeah, 0.3 of a millimeter off. So then I went ahead and just um, drilled the new holes in this plate. And that's what these studs are. 